keep it on. Now the moment we've all been waiting for to introduce to you. Yeah, sure, clap it up. We don't even know, just clap. Now, your underclassmen, 2013 homecoming, Prince and Princesses Grays, 9 through 11. Kurt. First up, for the freshmen, we have ninth grader Brooke Tucker Beamer. Brooke's parents are Roger Beamer, Bitt, Michelle Bitts. Brooke's involved in volleyball and in student council. Her favorite class is math, and in the future, she hopes to attend U of M to become a doctor. And we have Jacob Moser. Parents are Jamie and Mark Moser. His activities include football and baseball. His favorite class is Spanish, and he. Future plans is to go to college. Next up for the sophomores, we have Ashley Adams. <laughs> Ashley's parents are Scott and Kendall Adams. She's involved in soccer and enjoys long walks on Buttercup Beach. Her favorite class is American Sign Language, and in the future, she hopes to graduate college and become a pharmacist. And we have Brandon Murphy, parents are here. We have 11th grader Marissa Edwards. Yeah. Marissa's parents are Ryan and Trisha Edwards. She's involved in volleyball and her favorite class is art. And in the future, she hopes to become an oncology nurse, practitioner, and to do missionary work. senior class candidates. First up for the girls, we have 12th grader Kelly Hazel. <laughs> Kelly's parents are Dolores and Dave Hazel. She's involved in varsity soccer and DECA and student council, and she likes to hang out with her best friend, Sonny Arbro, in her free time. Favorite class is art with Mr. Kelsey, and in the future, she hopes to attend a university and major in marketing. And we have Jacob Davis. For the girls, we have senior Jordan McDermott. <laughs> Jordan's parents are Jennifer and Jason McDermott. She's involved in track, cross country, and the National Honor Society. Her favorite class is French and geometry with the Mr. Logan. And in the future, she hopes to attend a university, run track in college, and major as a physician assistant and minor in nutrition. C.J. O'Brien. <laughs> Macy's parents are Tom and Deanna O'Brien. She's involved in varsity cheer, dance, hanging out with her BFF Aubrey, telling jokes, and coaching boys powder puff cheer. Her favorite class is AP Macro with Miss Hobb and accounting with Miss Fanning. And in the future, she hopes to plan to go to a university and major in something math related. Joanne. Joanne. Joanne's Dinah. She's the she's the owner. Next, for the 
girls, we have Chanel Phillips. <laughs> Chanel's parents are Gina and Bob Phillips. She's involved in student council, track, gymnastics, and spending quality time with her best friend, Kaylee Torak. Her favorite class is art with Mr. Kelsey, and in the future she hopes to attend Grand Valley State and go into imaging sciences. cheer, tennis, and she does not hang out with Macy even though her bio says that she says she's lying. Um, her favorite class is AP Macro with Miss Ah. And in the future she wants to go to college and be a cheerleader. is we're going to start our Q&A session. We're going to ask the candidates a question and then they're going to have to answer the question accordingly. We're going to start with the girls. Kelly Hazel, please step forward. Back, back, back. One more step. No, like back and then to your left. Back, back. First question, what's the most significant accomplishment you think you've made in your life? I 
I would wish to be swept off my feet by an amazing, beautiful, talented, most perfect person named Taylor Walker. <laughs> Chanel Phillips. <laughs> Chanel, if you could define the word success in your own terms, what would it be? Well, for me, I think it would have to be just being happy and having no regrets. All right. In the uh, outside linebacker, Chad Williams, what is the biggest problem facing kids today? <laughs> boy bands. Yeah. Yeah. Boy bands. Amen. I agree. Next, for the girls, we have Miss Aubrey Root, or Aubrey Smith. Aubrey, who is the most famous person in the world? Third hour, you're gonna vote. Yeah, right now, you're gonna go to your home. Place. 